very much, Chris, for that kind, uh, if brief introduction. It is great to be virtually with all of you uh, in the uh, Windsor-Essex region. Uh, Chris Lewis, of course, is a, a legend both in your community and now in the House of Commons in your community for literally fighting fires. Uh, he was a firefighter. And now on Parliament Hill, he's lighting political fires uh, for the government uh, to put out all the time. In his community, uh, he and his family became famous for an incredible company that was able to actually fix underground sewers without actually digging underground uh, using robot technology. Um, but uh, the great thing I like about Chris is he's a champion of the working people. No surprise coming from a working class industrial heartland like uh, Windsor, Essex. He champions uh, the common people, uh, not the elites, uh, or as uh, Churchill described, the sort of ruling class uh, cultural elites that think they can decide for others. The, he called them the, the glittering scum that floats upon the river of production. Um, Chris, on the other hand, champions the, the working masses who carry the nation. Uh, and uh, those people are who we're fighting for in this coming election. And the choice is very clear. It's between force and freedom. That's what it comes down to. Force versus freedom. Everything government does, it does by force. The bigger government gets, the more force we have. Everything outside of government happens through the voluntary exchange of willing citizens. And that's why I believe in small and limited government. Small government means big citizens. Uh, and uh, that's what I want. I want everybody to be masters of their own destinies. Uh, Sparunchi, will you be a proponent of no more lockdowns? They kill our main street merchants, hurt our children, and impoverish families while they prove nothing. Look, there's, with, with people now being vaccinated, there's no longer a justification for any lockdowns. So um, that ans the answer then is yes.